The track's very narrow and it's all corner after corner after corner, you know. So it's hard to find your your you know marker points always in the dark, you know. Yeah. It's not lit up anywhere, so it's really crucial the lights work well, you know. You, you look in the mirror, you know, there's no one there. Next thing you look, the, the lights right there. I mean, it's they come up on you so quick, it's incredible. You try to let them pass you either on the entry to the corner or the exit of the corner, so you can carry your speed through the corner, you know. That way you lose the minimum amount of time. You've got to be very aware of what's going on behind you and, and anticipate their sort of their their um, the speed, their closing speed, you know, so you can let them by either before or you make sure you close the door so they can't dive underneath you going into the corner. You know, you never really sleep properly, you sort of nod over for now and then, you know. But yeah. The best time is normally around sort of five, six in the morning. You know, the sun's coming up, the track is cool. That's normally when the lap times are the quickest. I think I passed about six of the Toyotas in the first lap, and then, you know, once we got out in the straight bits, they came flying by again, but it was fun. It was a good couple of laps there.